Hello future engineers, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're still new to my channel and you like what I'm doing, please don't forget to share my videos to your friends and to your friends' friends. That's the only way you can also help them discover my channel. And of course, to keep me going, refresh and energize with this uh, very tiring work and to inspire me, please don't forget to subscribe. By moment distribution method, determine the internal moment at B. EI is constant. So this problem was solved using slope deflection equation. This time, let's verify the answers by moment distribution method. So let's have a strip here. So the intensity of load as to x, let's call that x equals 45 over 6. Since 45 over 6 is equal to 7.5, therefore this is 7.5x. So the differential force is 7.5x dx. Likewise, on this case, let's call this x. So this is 30 dx. Differential P is 30 dx. The fixed end moment AB, therefore, is equal to negative integral of 7.5x, x, 9 minus x, this is 9 minus x, quantity square over 9 square. So 7.5x, x, x, 9 minus x square over 9 squares from 0 to 6. So the fixing moment is negative 144 kilonewton meter for AB. Fixing moment BA is the same integral, positive, 0 to 6, x is squared this time, then we have 9 minus x over 9 squared. So it is equal to 1 to 6 kilonewton meter. Fixing moment BC is negative integral 30 dx. This is 6 minus x times x squared over 6 squared. 0 to 4. So it is negative 160 over 3 kilonewton meter, while fixing moment CB is positive integral 30 dx, 6 minus x square, x over 6 square. And it is positive 80 kilonewton meter. Let's now tabulate. So by the way, the stiffness of this member AB or BA is because the far end A is pin, the moment is zero. So this is modified by multiplying three fourths. Three fourths of one over nine is one over twelve. Likewise for BC or CB, the stiffness is because the far end has zero moment at C, it is modified by multiplying three fourths. So three fourths of, of one over six. Three fourths of one over six is 1 over 8. So the distribution factor for A, let's now prepare the tabulation. The distribution factor for A is negative 1. That's the technique, make it negative so that we don't worry about changing signs after distributing moments and balance moments. At B, it is one, negative 112 over 112 plus 1 over 8, so it is negative 0.4. Therefore, here it's negative 0.6. And at C, it's negative 1. Fixing moments, so we have at A, negative 1 for fixing moment, negative 1 for 4, 126 here, negative 160 over 3 here, and 80 here. Then distribute. So negative 144 times negative 1 is 144. Quantity 126 minus 160 over 3 times negative 0.4. Put it here, negative 29.067. Then quantity negative quantity 126 minus 160 over 3 times negative 0.6. Put it here, negative 43.6. 80 times negative 1, negative 80. So we notice that the moment at A is now 0. So let's lock joint A finally. Then the moment is 0 
as well as at sea. So carry over next. Because this is already balanced and at sea balance, we don't need to carry over half of negative 29.067 here. But instead, 144 over 2 carry over it here. So 72. Negative, we don't need to carry over half of negative 43.6 to join C because C is already balanced and that's the final moment. So therefore, that's my technique. Therefore, only half of negative 80 should be carried over in this joint. So negative 40. So these are now the unbalanced moment. The unbalanced moment would be 72 minus 40 for joint B. So let's distribute. So quantity 72 minus 40 times negative 0.4 is put it here. Negative 12.8. Quantity 72 minus 40 times 0.6 put it here. So it is negative 19.2. Since we cannot carry over half of these values to joints A and joint C, and joints A and C cannot also carry over half of the moments there because we did not touch these joints anymore because they are already finalized. So that means this is the last step and we we lack finally joint B. So adding these moments in this column, the moment at so the moment at A is zero. Here it's negative 156.133, so here should be positive 156.33, moment at C is 0. So that means the moment at B, the interval moment at B is negative 156.133 kN. So that's it for this problem. I hope that you were able to follow this simple problem.